marketing, enrollment, um, economical management, logistics. So in fact, conference support is somehow in this process is also involved. So when we are talking about conferences, then we have to talk mm -hmm. about on demand analysis and so on. So somehow this this point is 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 a process which is running through so uh, those processes. Because the and, and is inside. Right. And 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 e learning is the same, I think, because you need a demand, you could, you need a course um, design, mm -hmm. you need a marketing for it, enrollment and so on. Right. So it, it's kind of a, a matrix what, what we have here right now. Um, and this is and we mean when we talk about specifically about conference services. We have also a value chain as uh, related to the conference services and also a value chain related to e-learning. Of course, we should uh, perhaps, if we have time and resources, to analyze the, the whole value chain. But this is the first approach. We are not going to have the final uh, solution for this uh, in this project mm -hmm. due to the lack of time we have now. But the first approach is good in order to have a new uh, fields open to improve the matrix in the future. Okay. I don't. I don't mention. I don't mean that we are not going to do that in the near future. But it could be a fantastic idea also to work uh, specifically a matrix for conference services, or a matrix just for face to face, or a matrix just for e-learning. It's a really good idea. If let me say a matrix for university management. So let's go and. Uh,